What's going on, everybody? You tuned in to another edition of our No Time for Talk, Just Time for Action podcast. And today I wanted to bring to you a video of a subject or a program called SSVF. This is something that I never heard of. I've seen a few postings on social media when we had veterans um, or different individuals asking for help for veterans. And I've heard a few people keep popping off SSVF, SSVF. So I'm like, hey, you know, what is that? Is that something that can help us out? Uh, so that's what this vehicle or that's what this video is designed uh, to talk about. So hopefully you guys enjoy. But before we get into that, uh, please do me a favor, uh, like this video, share this video, and most importantly, subscribe to our channel. We're trying to get up to 50 subscribers by the end of the month. Also, if you can, check out our raffle at veterans59.com. We're doing a motorcycle raffle. Those proceeds will definitely go to supporting service members and veterans in need. So without further ado, let's hop into the video. So what is SSVF? That is Support Services for Veterans Families. And SSVF is twofold. They want to rapidly rehouse veteran families who are homeless and provide emergency rental assistance to prevent evictions. Uh, so basically, this is you are on the verge of becoming homeless. This program is meant to try and stop that, to jump in immediately and stop you from becoming homeless. Uh, this can include veterans in a housing crisis, risk of homelessness, financial crisis. You also could uh, be looking for resources uh, to help you navigate that financial crisis, that housing crisis, even child care, legal care, or access to health care. Um, that is what this program does. This is a program through the VA. What the VA does is the VA relies on local nonprofits uh, to help them facilitate the assistance of the program. Uh, so obviously the VA will give these local nonprofits, uh, local non-charities money, uh, so they can then go and assist these veterans or at least point them in the right direction uh, of how to get uh, assistance. Um, Let's see what we got here. Uh, and the great thing is you don't, again, like I said, you don't have to walk into your local VA to sign up for uh, any of the SSVF uh, programs or to get assistance. Uh, the local organizations that partner with the VA, they are supposed to be able to walk you through this. Actually, I'm gonna go to a website to show you where you can sign up online. Uh, but you might be saying, hey, you know, so you're in Arizona. Where are those resources at? Who, who holds the keys? Who, who got the grants? You know, who are the people that we should be contacting if, if we need some assistance? So I'm gonna share my screen with you guys. Uh, and I only found a couple, uh, at least uh, here in Arizona. So again, uh, www.va.gov slash homeless slash SSVF. Uh, so again, we have a website right here. Um, funding opportunities, uh, notice of funding. Uh, definitely, if you're a nonprofit supporting veterans, uh, they do welcome competition. So I would highly, highly recommend uh, you look at the PowerPoint and you see if this is something that you could apply for. I know Veterans Slide and Nine in the future will definitely be applying for this. Uh, but as far as the calendar year 2022 or funding year 2022, let's take a look and see who has won this. So just quickly skimming through this, I think I had about four. Um, I go to page 11. Looks like I have National Community Health Partners, $1,279,256 dollars. You also have Catholic Charities, $1,115,100. I scroll on down to page 30. Let's see what we got. Page 30, we have Primavera Foundation, another million plus. We have Community Bridges, two million plus. And scroll down to page 35. I also had United States Veterans Initiative, uh, 3 million plus. Um, so those are just some of the organizations that I've noticed uh, here in Arizona, just a quick skim of you know 
uh, the people who gotten this money to assist with this SSVF program. So again, uh, I'll put this, better, uh, this video out there, uh, hopefully for people who are asking or veterans who need it, uh, that's what this program is for. Looks like it's to definitely uh, help you not go into homelessness. It's not a long-term homelessness program. That's more of your HUD bash program, uh, but this is you know short fix. Uh, they even pay back rent. Another one of the things they do is these shallow subsidies where I think they pay up to 30% of your mortgage or your rent. And there's no penalty if you increase your um, income during that time. So that's also nice. So again, if you're somebody getting 30% of your uh, you know, uh, mortgage bill paid and you're increasing your income, uh, that's only gonna help you further yourself and uh, obviously not hit that poverty and become homeless. So that's what I got to you for you guys today. Um, SSVF, hopefully I'll, I'll put this out there. Hopefully this helps uh, some individuals, any veterans or family, so veterans in need, um, definitely contact your local uh, nonprofit that the VA has entrusted with this funding to assist. Uh, if you are a nonprofit out there looking to be one of those partners with the VA, uh, definitely check out this notice of funding for year 2023. Check out the PowerPoint. Uh, like I said, they welcome competition. So if you're out there getting it and you're helping veterans, hey, low power to you. Uh, you know, if you're a small organization like us and, and maybe you're looking for that next bump to jump into the millions or whatever, hey man, you know, make it happen. Uh, veteranspot9.com, veteranspot9.com. Definitely check out our website. Uh, definitely, uh, if you haven't already, go ahead and purchase some tickets to get you uh, a motorcycle, check out all the details, um, and definitely uh, look into this SSVF because I think it's a great program, and I think there's a lot of good organizations out there who can utilize this funding, uh, utilize this resource uh, to help more veterans. So, if there's anything else that I, uh, you guys would like me to do a video on, please let me know. Maybe I'll do a video on uh, actually how to fill out the application or go through that process, but. Nonetheless, let me know. Great resource. Uh, you guys have a great day and stay blessed. <laughs>